Hey guys, welcome to Beyond the Warriors. I'm the Naked Athlete, and this is Hacked in a Nutshell. Before I tell you about this episode, let me introduce you to a friend of mine, my new friend. This is my new-ish GoPro 5. Um, I'm going to be bringing you lots of uh, footage of my runs. I'm looking forward to that. I have the most beautiful running area in the world, I think. And uh, I think I'm going to enjoy filming some of that for you. There's also one of these holy things as well, so I can run with it. Should be fun. Now, Hillcrest Aid Centre is obviously very central to this entire endeavour. Without them, I would probably be in bed right now. So I think it's important that I get to share with you what they are and, and um, why, I'm, why I've chosen to, to support them as my charity. Let's chat to Candice Davidson, CEO of HACT, and uh, she can tell us all about HACT and what they're all about. Candice. Can you tell us what HACT is in a nutshell? HACT is a community-based and registered non-profit organization. We were founded in 1990 by the Hillcrest Methodist Church and was one of the first non-profits in South Africa to respond specifically to the growing and emerging epidemic of HIV AIDS. HACT adopts a holistic and family-centered approach to the HIV AIDS epidemic. And we do this by focusing on projects and services that are sustainable, that are practical, and that are community-led. Some examples of these include HIV care, education, prevention and awareness, economic empowerment, skills development, as well as general community development. And we do this to really empower individuals and families to um, to strengthen their position, to reduce vulnerabilities, and contribute to the development of South Africa. What vision is HACT striving for? HACT's vision is an AIDS-free South Africa, and all of our projects work toward that dream. Collectively, our programs and services help thousands of people every year, the majority of whom are women and young and orphan and vulnerable children and youth. And what is your mission? HACK's mission is to provide unconditional love and hope to anyone impacted by HIV AIDS. Unconditional in that we are inclusive and welcoming to all. For those that don't work across the road from HACT, where can we find them? HACT is located directly on the Comrades route. We are in Hillcrest, KwaZulu Natal, South Africa. And our partnership with Comrades is extra special because we are the only charity on the route and runners go right through the communities of the Valley of a Thousand Hills where the majority of our beneficiaries as well as the majority of our staff come from. Tell me about the HACT team. HACT is governed by a voluntary board of trustees who bring expertise from various fields. Our staff team consists of about 95 individuals who bring a wide range of gifts and talents to the organization. And this includes everything from nurses to counselors to our nursery and craft shop staff, as well as child and youth care workers who visit families within their homes. HACT is also supported by a big team of volunteers who come alongside us and collectively work together to provide the life-saving and life-changing work. One final question. What values does HACT adhere to? HACT is guided by five core values. The first value is passion, and that's to serve with passion, energy, and commitment, and acknowledge that it's a privilege to serve others. Faith, and that's seeking to do as Jesus would do. He gave us a commandment to love those around us. Integrity, and that means the message and the messenger must be the same. We must practice what we preach and be honest in all things. Ubuntu, meaning I am because you are. We are community driven and constantly aware that our actions impact those around us. And the sum is always better than the parts. Our last value is empowerment. And that is empowering people to take ownership of their own lives. Thanks, Candice. 
I hope to bring you a tour of the hacked premises um, next week. I'll go down there with my new best friend and uh, I'll show you what they get up to and their projects and that sort of thing. And then later this week we've got uh, kilometers 80 to go through to 70 to go of the comrades. Um, I'm ready to release that so that'll be the, later this week. But right now it's time for our hacked fact. While South Africa accounts for only 1% of the world's population, we account for 19% of the global burden of HIV. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to look later this week as the route continues. Don't forget to share, subscribe, like. Remember, we're doing it for the kids. Bye.